Hi, my name is Aaron and I'm currently a student at the University of Pikeville in Pikeville, Kentucky. I'm currently in my sophomore year. And around mid-April every year, a festival comes to the city called Hillbilly Days. And this is the second one that I've experienced, so I've decided to make a mini film about it. Okay, so how did this all start? Hillbilly Days was first founded in 1977 by a group of Shriners who were trying to raise money for their Shriners Hospital. Ever since, 100,000 people have been coming every year to experience Appalachian culture. Side note, a hillbilly is defined as an unsophisticated country person associated originally with the remote areas of Appalachia. So essentially, the whole reason this festival has been created is simply to raise money for the Shriners Hospital, which is great, and to allow people to experience Appalachian culture first hand. For me the whole festival is absolutely crazy. Having never seen anything like this before or anything remotely close it's been great to see Appalachian culture first hand and really get a grasp of it. Each day for me was full of good music, good food and fun rides. There was so much food that I wanted to try it all looked so good but I ended up opting for fried Oreos which was a pretty good choice. I did also try some of Aunt Ruth's donuts which were absolutely amazing. Music pretty much goes on all day around the city at Pikeville City Park and outside the Expo Centre. The music played here is something that you really would anticipate of being associated with a hillbilly festival and I really did enjoy it. The carnival area was packed full of people, old and young, and everyone was just having a great time. I asked a few people how long they had been coming to hillbilly days. This is my second year. Uh, I love it. I love the donuts as well. 24, so <laughs> every year. I was gonna say I've been five. Yeah, about five times. What they enjoyed most about the festival. Oh, I liked all the good music and the crowd and the people watching the band. Music. I love the people. Some people didn't even live in Kentucky, but made the long drive to come and experience the festivities. For me, my favourite part about Hillbilly Days was definitely experiencing the culture and just experiencing something new in general. Although I'd never seen anything like this before, I still had a really good time and I thoroughly enjoyed it. When I end up going back home, I try and explain this whole event to my friends and they just simply don't understand. It's something that you really have to experience firsthand to understand at all. I can't wait for the next one.